ओके दिस रोम इज एक्चुअली प्रिवेसी ओरिएंटेड प्रिवेसी फोकस कस रोम द नेम इज कैलिक्स ओ एस वन ऑफ द मोस्ट फेमस नेम्स ऑफ कॉर्स आई ट्राइड दिस ओस फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम ऑन माई डिवाइस एंड इट्स अन ऑफ इस्ट अवेलेबल फॉर एडमी नोट टेन प्रो एंड प्रो मैक्स यूजर्स Let's just talk about some of the basic things about this one. For example, the Android version. It's not Android 13. It's Android 12. And yes, Android 12 is quite good. This custom is not like the other AOSP based or pixel based customs. It's actually something else, something different. I'll talk about all those things in this video. So stay tuned. First of all, this is the setup scheme. Whenever you set up your device for the first time while installing Calix OS, this is how the UI will look like. Yes, it's something different, something unique. It will ask you to review some additional. Additional apps which you want to install or not, it's up to you. And all these apps are open source apps. You might probably have installed on other devices too, but in this one, you have all these apps pre-installed. This is quite good, of course. Let's just take a quick look at the default launcher. As expectedly, we have the Quick Step Launcher pre-installed. Quick Step Launcher is quite lightweight and it it does not have many features. But we have some developer options which are quite usable, I think so. Let's just take a look at the some security options which I found were quite useful, to be honest. Like I found here two good options. For example, the panic button and the auto reboot. Auto reboot might be available in Dubfest OS also, but panic button is quite interesting. If you're able to see in power menu, I have panic trigger. As far as I know, this option is not available in any other custom room so far. Whenever you enable the panic button, you have the option to confirm that. App. For example, whenever you enable the panic button, this app will be hidden. This app will be reset, and something like that. If you use and check it out, you will find it useful for you. These things can be customizable. By the way, the app will be closed. You can hide the app, the reset the app. It's up to you. Whenever these things will happen, you can customize these things alongside that panic button. We also have the micro G pre-installed. It's almost same like the previous custom. Maybe EOS. I made a video on that. If you don't, if you are not sure about that, I'll give you the link in the description for that. Or that's available in the I button. Make sure to check out that. You have the option to add a Google account. So this is optional. If you don't want any Google Google account. By the way, it does not make sense by using this custom and adding your Google account. It's not for privacy. Then, if you were looking for the Google Play Store alternative, yes, it's already present. The name is Aurora Store. You can install that on any other devices too as an APK file. In Aurora Store, you have the option to install any other apps. For example, mostly open source apps are basically a very good alternative of Google Play Store, and almost every app from the Google Play Store is available here. So this is a very good choice, I think. Alongside Aurora Store, which is available by default in this one, where you can install and explore all these apps, we also have some VPN apps which are pre-installed. We are using Calix OS, so Calix VPN is already pre-installed. You can configure it according to your own preference. If you want to, I will not be able to show you all these things. I will not be able to show you the exact things which are going on. We also have the Chrome alternative, which is basically not Chrome. It is actually Chromium, which is an ad block, ad blocking app, ad blocking browser app, which is available on GitHub, and all these apps are open source. We have many things which you can do with this default browser app too. Android is also one of the famous open source app repository where you can get all these open source apps and also free and install it very easily as an APK files on your device. Same like all other apps, the alternative of Gmail is also there. The name is K9 Mail. You need Gmail, you can use K9 Mail for sure. We also have another VPN which is now related to dark web. The name is Orbot, which is also very useful VPN app and it's based on Tor as far as I know. And also, Tor is actually one of the most powerful apps available on the internet. One more thing which I found here is this: the scrambled exif. Whenever you share any picture, you have all the details already available where the photo is clicked and how that that exact location, time, etc. With this app, you can remove that information, which is super useful, of course, for you. And yes, I was talking about the Tor browser. It is also pre-installed. It will from this you will be able to access dark web on your device. And if you don't know what is dark web, you can check out Google.com, and it's very popular. You must know about that, what it is, and how you can access that. Alongside all other things, it also has a work profile pre-installed, which means if you don't know, you can install Island app on any Android device to configure work profile and install some other apps in a, in a different environment. And all these things are also pre-installed in this one, and this is also one of the most interesting things about this custom room. I think so.
So these were things I just want to let you know about this Galax OS, one of the most interesting custom officially available for some of the Google Pixel devices. The link for those devices is already available in the description and unofficially available for Redmi Note 10 Pro too. Link for that is available in the description too. This is all. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.